Hey there, you guys. Coach Nick here. Um, thank you for joining us. We're actually going to get started with our toddler football class. Um, if you've joined us in the past, we appreciate you joining us. Um, and now we're going to get into some football. This is for ages two to four. We're going to have a lot, a lot of fun. Make sure you have enough space around you to get your class going, to have space to run, jump, throw, things like that. We're going to get going with a lot of things for football. Before we do that, we got to make sure we stretch, get those muscles loose, our body warmed up. So we're going to start with our stretches. So spread your feet out, spread your feet out just a little bit. It doesn't have to be huge like this. We don't have to go that big. We're going to get a little closer. Try to make sure it's shoulder width apart. All right, so we're going to start here. You're going to raise your left hand with your left hand. Go down to your left foot like this. And we're going to keep our legs straight. Make sure you touch your feet, okay? Try to touch your feet, touch your ankle. We're going to count to 10. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good, very good. Raise your right arm. Raise your right arm. Go down to your right foot. Let's do the exact same thing. Keep those legs straight. Touch your foot, touch your ankle, how far you can go. Let's find out. Count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Now take both hands as high as you can go and go right down the middle and touch the floor in front of you. Count to 10. Keep those legs straight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, very good. All right, we're gonna move our arms out. We're gonna put them out to the side. All right, we're gonna start with tiny circles, just like this. Tiny, it doesn't have to be very big. Just get those arms moving. Very good, very good. Now we're gonna make it a little bit bigger. These are our medium circles, medium circles, just like this, just a little bit bigger. Very good, we'll take those arms, very good. Now our biggest ones, our biggest circles. Very good, very nice, very nice. Big circles, big circles. Big ones, big ones, big ones. Now freeze, hold it out, hold it out. Don't put your arms down. Freeze, freeze, freeze. We're gonna keep it going. We're gonna do tiny wings, little wings, front to back, front to back. Do not rotate your arms, just little bitty wings. These are little wings like a mosquito. Little wings like a ladybug. Very good. Now bring them close together. Do not let them touch as close as you can. Do not let them touch. These are medium wings. These are like a uh, hawk or a falcon. Medium wings or an eagle. Very good, don't let them touch, don't let them touch. You should not hear your hands clap. Now give yourself a big hug, big hugs, big hugs, big hugs. Very good, very good. Nice, this is like a dragon. This is like a pegasus. Very good, big, big, big wings. Pterodactyl wings. And hold the last one, hold it tightly, tightly, tightly. Very good, hold it tight, hold it tight. Give yourself a big hug, big hug. Very nice, very nice. All right, now we're gonna go side to side. Spread your feet a little bit. Just moving our upper body. Twist, we're gonna twist left to right. Let's count to 10 for this one, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Now we're gonna jog and touch. You're gonna stay right where you are. Just move your arms and your legs up and down. We're gonna jog and touch. Let's do it for 20 seconds, ready? One. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and go into some jumping jacks. So with this one, I know it can be confusing. So what we like to describe it as you wanna start off in a pivotal position just like this. Feet together, hands together, side by your side, and then we go into a star position. Just like a star, very good, and pencil. Very good, and a star, pencil. And we can start getting faster, star, pencil, star, pencil, just like that, and we can keep it going. We can go for five of them. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Very good, very good, very good. All righty. I think our bodies are warm. You guys warmed up out there. Hope you are. Hope you've been following along so far. We're going to get to our football lesson. So what we're going to start with today is our eggs to the nest. If you joined us last week for baseball, we did this game. This is a popular game here at JC Sports. So the way to work, find a pillow, blanket, a hoop, somewhere you can bring your ball back to. Um, we are playing football. That doesn't mean you have to have footballs. 
You can use rolled up socks, you can use a bouncy ball, any kind of ball that you have in your house. Bring them all together, as many as you can, the more the better. Bring them all together, bring an area where you can bring it back. I'm gonna use the lid. So this is gonna be my nest today. So I'm gonna set this down on the opposite side. Actually, I'll leave it here. I'll set it down here. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna take all the balls that I have here in this bucket, and I'm gonna throw them out all over the floor. Just like this. Just like this, very good. So I want you to do the exact same thing. Put them all over your room. If you're outside, put them outside, your living room, whatever you're doing. And now, we're gonna find out how quickly we can pick these up. Grab them one at a time, nothing more. When you pick it up, I want you to grab it and tuck it right under your arm and keep it safe because you don't want to drop it. You don't want anybody to take it away from you. When you grab it, you're gonna run as fast as you can. Put it where your nest is. Like I said, it could be a blanket, a pillow, a hoop, somewhere where you're bringing all these back to you. Now, when I say go, we're gonna go as quickly as we can. See if you guys can beat Coach Nick. Are you ready? Set, go. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Here we go, we got one. Remember, tuck it under that arm. We got another one, tuck it under. Only one at a time, one at a time, tuck it under. Bring it back to your pillow, blanket, hoop, whatever you're using. I want you to go as quickly as you can. Only one, only one. Pick it up. Put it down, hurry, hurry, hurry. Quickly. Put it down, put it down, tuck it under your arm. Under your arm, under your arm. Very good. You guys are doing fantastic. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Who's gonna go faster than Coach Nick? Find out. Go, 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 go. Quickly, quickly. You guys are moving so fast. I love it. I love it. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Don't stop, don't stop. We're almost there. Almost there, almost there. Very good, very good. One at a time, one at a time. Don't forget that. Focus on tucking it under. Keep that ball safe. Keep those socks safe. Keep going, keep going. Almost done. Coach Nick has four more. Are you going to beat Coach? There you go. Good job. Keep going, keep going. Keep going. Almost done. Last one, last one, last one. Quickly, let's go easy. Go, go, go. Almost done. Almost done. Very good. Very good. Very good. All right, what I want you to do at home, uh, this is your chance to take a break. 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 Take a Three, four, six, seven, ten, twelve, fourteen, eighteen, twenty-one. 10, 12, 14, 18, 21. Who has more than 21? Who be coached in? Let me know, let me know. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Who has more than 21? Ooh, that's very good. I'm gonna put this away. We're gonna move on to our next game, all right? This is your chance to get some water, catch a breather. You guys have been working really hard. Keep it up. Very good, very good. All right. On to the next game. All right, for this one, you are going to use a blanket. You can use a blanket of your own, or a sheet, or a towel, whatever you want to use. It doesn't have to be this big, whatever you want to use. Bring it out, and then I'm gonna grab a few of my balls. One, two, three, let me see. I'm gonna grab five. You can grab more if you need to. This is just to show you what you guys need to do. You're gonna put them underneath the blanket, the towel, the sheet, whatever you're using, curtain, whatever it is. Place them under. You wanna pretend that they're hiding from you. You have to go find them. So that's what we're gonna do. Coach is gonna start on one end. When I say go, you gotta run as fast as you can. Go under that sheet, under that curtain, whatever it is you're using, under that towel, and collect the ball. So it's gonna look something like this. So when I say go, go as quickly as you can. Go underneath, and then you grab the ball. All right, are we ready? Set, go! Go, 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 Oh, we're fast, we're fast, we're fast. Set it down. Here we go. All right. I want to see how many 
what you can get as quickly as you can. Let's see if you can do seven in two minutes, okay? So I want you to go under that blanket, under that curtain, under that towel, grab as many as you can, okay? Quickly, quickly. I'm gonna do it one more time. So you guys can see how this goes. So I'm gonna put this on top. You guys gotta crawl under, okay? Here we go. Ready? Set, go. Get up, 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 get now, for our next one, we are going to do a game called Ring of Fire. We've done it in the past, but instead of it moving, we're going to keep a so solid target for us to throw to. You use a hoop if you have one. If not, find a laundry basket, find a bin, find a container, something you can throw the wall through or at to have a target. So with this, we'll use five footballs again. Collect five footballs. Find somewhere you're gonna start, okay? Here's your footballs. You can put it here. You start on this opposite end. Here's my footballs. And we're gonna try to throw it through our target or at our target. We grab one ball. Remember when we use our ball, when we throw our football, you wanna hold it tight. You wanna stand sideways. Make sure your body is straight facing one direction. And put your ball up in a muscle. We call it a muscle. Or if you want to talk on the phone, hello, hello, hello. Pick it up, hold it tightly. Before we throw, you got to make sure we point, whether it's with our finger or our hand, you point in the direction you want to throw. You take a step forward and you throw it as hard as you can, okay? So I want you guys to remember those steps. You turn sideways, you uh, make sure your ball is up. You don't want to have it down, you don't want to hold it too tight. You want to have it upright, okay? You want to hold it up like this, like a muscle. Remember, like you're making a muscle. So you hold it up, you point, take your step, and throw. Very good, very good. So now what we can do, if you, if you like that, you can move it to a different position, turn it just a tad, find somewhere else to throw it from, grab another ball, and you can move somewhere else, okay? You can do the same thing. Remember, you turn, pick that ball up, point, step, Throw. All right, let's move it somewhere else. Let's find a new spot to throw this through. This is called our ring of fire. You see how many we can get in a hoop. Count how many you get. And let us know how many you make through that hoop, band, hamper, or whatever you're using. Remember, you turn sideways, pick that ball up, point, step, throw. All right, this is our last one. I'm gonna put it right here for you guys, right in the middle. I'm gonna go right back here. You're gonna look at your target, point. Make sure you turn sideways first. Get ahead of myself, turn sideways. Point, oh, pick up your, your hand. Make sure it's high. Point, step, and throw. Very good, very good. All righty, all righty. I hope you guys are having fun with that one. Let us know how many you got, how many you made through your hoop, or your, your laundry basket, or your bin. And I'm gonna clean this one up. We're gonna get moving. Uh, this is your time to take a break, or if you really enjoy that game, do it again or any of the other games we've done in this class. Let me get moving so we can get to our next activity. All righty. All right, all right. Make sure you're staying hydrated. Get some water if you need it. Get some water if you need it. All right. Let's see, our next one. Ooh, this one's really, really fun. Uh, this is where we will be. Okay. If you have a balloon, you don't have, if you don't have a balloon, you can use a regular ball, whatever you want to use. But we're going to practice punting the ball. So punting is another word we use for kicking the ball. It's just a, a different way you do it in football. So with our, our balloon, you hold it out in front of you. Uh, you drop it, and then we're going to kick as high as we can. It doesn't matter how far it goes right now. We just want to kick it high. So make sure you put two hands on it. When you drop it, you're going to try to kick it up, OK? Remember, you don't have to have a balloon. If you have a balloon, it doesn't have to be this big. It's however big you want to make it. 
So grab your balloon, put it down in front, give me a drop, and kick it as high as you want. Very good. We're gonna do that again. Hold your ball out in front. I mean, not your ball, either your ball, your balloon, whatever you're using. Hold it out in front, drop, kick. Very good. If you wanna challenge yourself, let's see if you can drop it, kick it, and kick it again. Let's see if we can kick it twice. All right, we're gonna drop it and punt the ball. Very good, very good. Last one, last one. I want you guys to kick this one as hard as you can, right? So put it out in front, put it out in front of you, just like this, drop, and punt the ball high. Very good, very good. You can keep this balloon, use it for another game you do later if you wanna try this balloon with something we've already done. All right, now we're gonna get to the fun part. This is probably my favorite thing we're doing today. Uh, it's just scoring the touchdown. That's, I think, a lot of people's favorite thing to do in football. It uh, gets people excited, gets people cheering. Uh, it scores points for your team. So we're gonna get into that. Before we go into the rules of that, I'm gonna set it up briefly. Uh, if you have any stuffed animals, any extra balls that you're not using, any cones, anything that can be used as an obstacle, you wanna bring it out now. Throw it out on the floor, anywhere um, in the space that you're using. So today, I'm gonna use my fishes. I have fishes, I have pigs, and I have chickens. So I'm gonna throw them out on the field. And we're gonna try our very best to score a touchdown. So I'm gonna throw these out. These are gonna be our obstacles or our defenders to keep us from scoring a touchdown. So you throw them out all over the floor, as many as you like, the more the better. The more will make it a little bit more challenging, but it does make for more fun. So, when you do that, you out all of this. If you guys are using something else, let us know what you're using. We would love to hear what you guys are, the creativity you guys are using. Right. So that's all over the place. That's a good thing. All right, so this will be our touchdown. We're going to bring our blanket back out. This is where we will go to score a touchdown. So you can bring your blanket out and you can put it on the opposite end. What you are going to do is try and score a touchdown. So you will start on one side with the ball. When I say go, you must tuck your ball underneath your arm and you got to run through all the defenders without touching them, okay? Your object is to stay away from them. Don't let them touch your feet. Don't let them take you down. And then you score on the, the black uh, the black mat that we have here or your blanket or, or whatever that you used earlier. All right, ready? Set, go. Ooh, ooh. And touchdown! Make sure that you celebrate. That's the most important part, the fun part. And do a celebration dance. Whoop, 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 whoop. There we go. If you want to do that again, we can do it again. This time, I want you to try and go backwards. Okay? So that may be a little bit more challenging. Ready? Set. Go. Oh no, oh no. Don't touch, don't touch, don't touch. Don't touch. Watch where you're going. Watch where you're going. Watch where you're going. Keep going, keep going. Oh no. I'm gonna stay, I'm gonna stay, I'm gonna stay. I'm gonna stay. Very good, very good. And touchdown! You gotta slam down the ball. You see your best dance moves for your celebration. Very good, very good. All right, my friends, I hope you had fun with that one. I'm gonna go one more time. This time, I'm gonna try to bear call you all of the fingers. Are you ready? Set, go. Oh, that game, oh, don't touch, don't touch, don't touch. see those moves very good all right you guys that is it for today i hope you guys had fun i had a lot of fun i hope you worked up a sweat i hope uh we see you guys on the next online class that we have we're having a lot of fun with these i'm having fun with these it's getting me up and moving um 
please share your videos, your pictures of you guys joining us. We'd love to see those. Thank you guys. Bye-bye.